Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. By this tutorial, we have already learned how to create NFTs using Canva and how you can list your NFTs on OpenSea. You can find the link to all those videos in the description box below. Now, in this tutorial, I will show you how to sell your NFTs. So without wasting any time, let's quickly begin. Go to your collection and select the item you would like to sell. At the top right corner, you can see the sell button. Click on sell. So before listing this item for sale, we need to enter a few details. The very first is the type, whether you want it to be fixed price or time options. If we will select fixed price, it will sell your NFT to the amount you will fix. And if you select timed option, it will sell your NFT to the highest bidder. So I'll keep it fixed price. So I'll fix the price to 0.1 ETH which is equal into $40.65. You can also change its currency. Then next is the duration. Duration is the number of days you want your item to be listed. And I'll select it for one month. So if I go to more options, it gives you two more functionality. The very first is to sell as bundle. If you want to sell your NFTs in a bundle, select sell as bundle and you can name your bundle, add some description and add more items. So basically you can create a bundle of four, five NFTs and sell them together. And the next option is to reserve for specific buyers. You can add their links and only they will be able to purchase your NFTs. Now before completing the listing, please make sure to see the fees. So service fee is the OpenSea charges that we have to pay when someone buys our NFT. So basically when someone buys my NFT for 0.1 Ethereum, I have to pay 2.5% of that amount to OpenSea. And creative fee is the royalty that we receive when someone who has bought our NFT tries to sell it further. Once you click on complete listing, it will ask for wallet permissions and once it is validated, your listing will be authenticated. Click on view item. And here you can see the current price we have set for the NFT. You can still enter the details for the NFTs, but we cannot change the price. The only thing we can do is we can either cancel the listing or lower the price. So if I have to lower the price, I can lower it to 0.05 and it will again ask for your confirmation and the price will be lowered. Or you can cancel the listing by clicking on cancel listing. And to cancel the listing also, it will ask for your wallet confirmation. Once it is validated, your listing will be cancelled. You can scroll down below to find all the events linked to this NFT. You can see we first listed this NFT for 0.1 Ethereum. Then we lowered the price to 0.05 Ethereum. Then we cancelled it. So that's it for today's video. I hope you like it. If you have any doubts or questions, do let me know in the comment section below. I love replying to them. And if you haven't yet watched how to create an NFTs, go and watch my video. I'll paste the link in the description box below. Bye bye, take care.